Bienvenidos, Bernie Bears, to the Bear Facts, where you receive the latest, the greatest, and the top news of everything that is happening around Alice Bernie Elementary. I am your host and school counselor, Miss C. And as always, this is your network. And for this first bit of news, I kind of need to tackle an important issue that has been brought to my attention by our network producers. And that is, is that we need to have our Bernie scholars aware that attendance is really important. It's really important that you are going to your morning virtual classes with your teacher, spending time with your friends as much as possible, as well as completing your assignments, showing us that you're learning, you're trying to your best basically in every single class. Now, there's a reason I'm saying this, and that is is because there are cool things happening, okay? First of all, friends, I know distance learning can be difficult, right? It's not easy. I know that sometimes we even have other technical problems. Our internet might not be working that day or um, I don't know. Sometimes it's just hard to learn because we are at home and we have other chores and things like that to do. But I'm really, really, really emphasizing that y'all should be in your classes every morning as much as possible. Complete your assignments and here's why. Okay. First of all, I don't want you to miss out on any learning. Your brains are growing and developing and you're like trees or flowers and all this knowledge, you're going to be able to soak it in and grow and flourish. And so I don't want you missing out on any important pieces of information. Secondly, it's because the network sent me some information that classes with perfect attendance for the month of August and September And the students that so far have had perfect attendance will be invited to a special underground DJ virtual party. And I'm not revealing who our DJ is. And no, I am not your DJ. I am your network host. Um, So making sure that's clear. Secondly, I was also notified that in the future, so like future months, like the month of November, December, January, we still will be looking for those classes and students with the top or perfect attendance, and they will be guests invited to a VIP list for other parties. And here's what I heard. Eventually, we are going to have a paint night with a special artist. We are going to have a grab bag of special treats that you will be able to come by and pick up from Alice Bernie. Sometimes we'll be mailing certificates or awards we'll also be having some lunch time with the principals yay um you may be invited to a special read aloud activity and last but not least and one of my favorites that i'm looking forward to and we're not going to tell you which month it is but we are going to have a glow in the dark dj dance party so i am super looking towards that friends so again come to class complete your assignments Be present as much as possible every single day, okay? Don't want you to miss out on learning or any of our fun future events. Now, this next segment is new. It is top secret news. So, this month of October, is National Principals Month, where we get to celebrate both our principals, Mrs. Gomez and Mrs. Noel, for all of the amazing things that they do for us. They do a lot of behind the scene things that sometimes we don't even know that they do, but they help with book distribution, they help purchase materials for us, they bring us a lot of opportunities, they're involved with helping us get like guest speakers, um, in providing lots of resources. They um, prov- they hang out with us during read alouds with the principal, kindness events, um, our assemblies, rock your school, and so many more things that they do. And so this month is our opportunity as students to go ahead and thank our principals in some way. Now, here's where the secret part comes in. And y'all know I don't like you telling people my secrets. So um, what I want to share with you is maybe consider thinking of a way that you can thank our wonderful 
Miss Gomez and Miss Numa for everything that they do for us, whether maybe sending them a little card or um, I don't know, writing them a special message. You guys can maybe come together as a class and figure something out, friends. So I just wanted to tell you guys that is top secret news. And don't tell other people, especially Miss Gomez and Miss Noel, so that we could surprise them. <laughs> All right, friends, top secret news out. And for some middle of the week fun, please join me once again this Wellness Wednesday at 2.30. You'll be able to find the bit.ly link right there. I'm going to be using the same link from now on, and I will be posting it to your Google Classroom. But just so you're aware, this Wellness Wednesday, you will need some supplies. You will need a rock. Um, a small rock that you can hold in your hand, um, preferably flat, but it doesn't have to be necessarily, but it's a lot easier to paint and um, draw images on if you get a rock that is kind of flat. If you don't happen to have a rock, you can also use maybe a little piece of wood or a piece of paper or any other little object that you have around your house that you want to draw on. Um, you will need either um, acrylic paint Watercolor might wash off, so you don't want to get watercolors. If you have something called acrylic paint, use that. Or if you don't, you can also use permanent markers. So you'll need one or the other. You don't necessarily need both. And last but not least, you may need a paintbrush if you use um, the acrylic paint. And that's all you're going to need for this Wellness Wednesday. So I hope to see you all there. Everyone is invited. And it'll be lots of fun. This Friday is Friendship Friday for all of my first, second, and third grade friends. You are invited to come join me on our WebEx meeting so we can play games, hang out, you can bring your snacks, tell your friends to come, and some of our teacher friends might join us too. We're going to be able to talk with one another, catch up, and even maybe play some games, and some people might win some prizes. If you didn't join us for last Friendship Friday, we were on a safari and we were trapped in Jumanji. We had to figure out how to escape from getting smashed by rhinos or from the motorcycles chasing us or from whatever other things we had to escape from in Jumanji. We had our teacher friends join us and we had a lot of fun. And there were prizes, but no one won. So... Fourth, fifth, and sixth graders, you're going to have to wait another Friday to come back for Friendship Friday. This Friday is only for first, second, and third grade. Can't wait to see you there, my friends. And all our teacher friends are invited. Thank you.